Hi everybody, I'm making my milk using my almond cow. I know I showed this one, once before, but I'm going to show you something different. I've had this machine almost about a year and I'm loving it. It saves me so much money on store-bought milk and I can make my own. This time I'm making it with walnut. So I always get the bowl and basket, walnuts, raw pieces, raw halves and pieces. Um, they're very good. They're vegan. They're non-GMO. They're gluten-free. There's five grams of protein. They're very good for you. And what I do is I put my agave in there, and I have a sweet tooth. I always add in my vanilla and a little bit of salt in the water so that it will stay. I'm going to get everything ready. I also add in dates. Yes, I have a sweet tooth. I will get everything ready and before I put everything in, I will show you. And these are the dates that I use. I got this big bag in Costco because it was so much cheaper. And it's organic and there's no pits, it's gluten free, it's nut free, it's delicious. Okay, my dates and my walnuts are in here now. Okay, it's only a cup of walnuts and I used four dates which I cut into small pieces. I don't soak them because you don't need to, but this is how small I do. And I mix everything up in here. The water is in here and you can see, I don't know if you can see it, the marking, it's up to the max. You can't go above that. And I have to open this part up and put everything in and I'm going to show you. This is the cup that you have to put the nuts in, and this is the blade. Hi, everybody! <laughs> okay, the nuts are all in here. I don't know if you can see it. Yep, there we go. Now we're going to put this inside this cup. It just lines it up and make sure it's tight. Now this whole thing goes inside of my cow, as I call it. And I'll show you. Everything is in now. So now there's a top button with the little cow. I gotta plug it in first. Now it's plugged in and then you just press this button. And it's making my milk. You hear it going, it stops and then it goes again. So before, once I had the nuts in there in the water, I then put maybe about two tablespoons of agave, a half a teaspoon of vanilla extract, and this is my little salt shaker because I love crabs. I a little bit of salt, it helps it. And it's done. I don't know if you can see the blue light, but it's a blue light. And you don't have to use agave, you can use maple syrup too. I just like agave. And here's the little jar they give me too. So it's got a little cow on there, it's so adorable. Well, here's my milk, if you can see it. I'm going to put it in my jar and then I will show you. Now, one more thing, you don't even need a cheesecloth. I used to make my milk out of my Ninja blender. Oh, what a hassle. I'd have to get a cheesecloth and strain everything. You don't. Everything is in this collection cup and I use the stuff that's in here. This is how I make, sometimes I'll make my ricotta cheese out of it, or um, you could make anything out of it, really. But this is like the best investment. And here is my walnut milk. And it actually, I taste it a little bit. It is delicious. And it's got a little cow on here. If anybody is ever interested, just send me a private message and I'll send you information. But almond cow, the best investment. I think I paid 250 and I got all the attachments to clean it. I got everything. It is the best. Please like and follow for more. Have a great evening, guys.